One of the things that we wanted to make sure we did is maintain our strengths and uh, keeping the bullpen together, uh, making sure the defense remains strong with Hoach and Frazier and I think some of the other competitions we have in the bullpen, obviously keeping Holly and Herrera and Wade, uh, you know, makes us perhaps even stronger. And then with Alex Rios, that addition in right field, uh, you know, we feel like that the outfield defense is, is uh, obviously spectacular, but maybe even better now. So, um, you know, I think that was important for us. And uh, but the, the success of our team is predicated on uh, our main players, uh, the guys that uh, we entered 2014 with uh, continuing to produce. And uh, we believe that uh, they're all capable of having better years in 15 um, compared to 14. So, uh, you know, we, we feel like we're better. Well, again, you want you need them to stay healthy. That's the most important thing. Is your starting rotation goes to the post every fifth day, and uh, you know your bullpen. Uh, obviously, they threw a lot of high leverage situations last year, a lot of intensity, an extra month, and uh, so uh, you know we want to make sure that uh, you know they get out of the gate strong and they're healthy. And uh, you know, it's, it, again, it's just a matter of it's, it's a very talented group, and uh, we always look for a thousand innings out of our rotation. That's been a goal of ours for day one. Uh, we've been close in making sure that happens. And as uh, long as the, the rotation uh, throws strikes, competes, and uh, gives us a chance to win, allow our defense to make plays, uh, I feel like that uh, our pitching staff will service us well. The division is spectacular. Some people say it may be the best division in baseball, and uh, you know we'll see at the end of the year if that uh, is indeed the case. But uh, certainly the White Sox have, have done a tremendous job. They're already, I thought, a very good team last year. And, you know, they have you know, an impact leadoff hitter, an impact four hole hitter, and they made additions to that lineup. Uh, they really improved their pitching staff and in the back end of their bullpen. Cleveland uh, has maybe the best power rotation in baseball, and uh, they always play very, very hard. And uh, it's an exceptional organization. And the Twins, you know, scored a lot of runs last year. And anytime you have Torrey Hunter and Joe Maurer in that lineup, you're going, you're going to be competitive. And, and their pitching staff with Santana and Hughes and some of the other young talent they have. Uh, is very good, and Detroit uh, is always exceptional. And uh, you know, I think that uh, you know they've uh, they're going to be the team to beat again, uh, just because of the mere fact that uh, you know they're always uh, you know they're, they're the reigning champs. So we've got to we've got to work hard, and uh, uh, hopefully we can go out there and uh, you know compete to win our division. You mentioned getting a thousand innings out of your starters. <clears throat> That's at 990 last year, I believe. 227 from James Shields. What does that mean for guys like your Donna Ventura and Danny Duff, the younger guys who are not going to be expected to, to pitch more? Well, they are, and um, you know that's they're they're obviously very talented, and um, you know, they're still uh, gaining that necessary experience. Uh, but uh, you know, again, hopefully they stay healthy and um, you know can just go out there and be real efficient with their pitches and go deep in games.